Okay, in Benin Republic, this is the way petrol is being sold. I've not seen anybody enter a petrol station. They sell petrols in jars like this, even on the roadside. Yeah, I don't know why that is so, but this is the way it is here. <laughs> What kind of fish? What kind of fish is this? So guys, um, I'm just I'm at the border between Bene and Togo. Yeah, I'm looking very stressed out. Um, to go into Togo, you have to pay 2,000 sefa. Yeah, to stamp so that Bene can stamp you into Togo. Then you pay another 2,000 sefa for Togo. To stamp you in so yeah hey guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is Ipoma and you're highly 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 welcome so like you guys already know or if you don't know already I'm doing a West African tour so I am in country number two I actually left Lagos um, to Benin Republic and um i'm in togo now i will go back to bene to do some activities but right now i am in togo so i am you know togo is known for very very lovely beaches i am in one of the beaches in togo so guys if you haven't subscribed to my channel kindly do so so that you're one of the first to get a notification anytime i upload a new video yeah so we are going to explore this four west african we are going to explore four west i'm going to explore four west african countries and you are going to explore it as well through my eyes so let's go guys and see what the beaches in togo look like you can see how beautiful the beach is i'm still going to the bit to the seafront yeah so that's it for now i'll explore other places and shoot a video for you guys to see this is actually a road trip i'll give you a breakdown of the cost and some other things so that you can at least use your passport that idea of you, you, you renew a passport every year and you don't get to go anywhere you are waiting for when you get an american visa or you get a schengen visa or you get canada visa while you can explore west africa if you explore these four countries with me you would actually have four stamps and what does those stamps do to your passport they help increase your travel history so and it's very inexpensive trust me there are several ways you could do this so i don't really think money should be an issue here so guys let's get to the beach and have some fun yep um part of the reasons why i'm also in the beach is because i want to practice grounding if you don't know what grounding is please google it it's something that you can do for yourself as part of self-care so it's basically working on barefoot on it helps relieve stress it has a lot of benefits so please google it i'm going to ground for like 30 minutes or more i've off to my sleepers yeah so i am going to ground for about 30 minutes at least 30 minutes i know you yeah this is the the sea so guys that's it can you guys see the sky the the how beautiful Togo is. You see those palm trees, 
they look so lovely. Yeah. And right behind me is the guara. Yeah. So try, try and visit. Do a weekend trip, or even take more days off. It will help your well-being. It's also part of self-care. Yeah. So guys, uh, the truth is, like, in, in Bene and in Togo, it is, they speak French. Do you understand? So if you don't know how to speak French, or if you don't see someone that speaks English, trust me, now sign language you go, they use you. That's the update. Now I want to, I just finished from the beach. I want to take a cocktail. In fact, I don't even know. She's speaking her own, I'm speaking my own. So what's this one now? Yuki. It's 500, Abby. Two. Two. Five, uh, one CD. One CD, not Sephi yeah. again. Ha. You are confused though. Me. Two la. So you see that thing I'm saying? Languages. No, no. Those of you that will be no. thinking because you know how to speak English that you've arrived. By the time you you carry that your English and leave the country and go to somewhere that they don't speak English, you understand that Omo. You are that is why it's good to travel. When you travel, you learn other people's way of life. You understand that when somebody speaks English and you for the fact that you even understand what that person is saying, forget about that their accent is Igbo Tiko, Yoruba Tiko, Aosa Tiko, Efik Tiko. The most important thing is that there is a communication and you both understand each other. So now they carry your shoulder up. Okay? Yeah. Guys, this um in this place, this babe has been saying cocktail, cocktail. Me, you know in Nigeria what we call cocktail. I don't know saying that this Mirinda. I've been a Fanta sister. Now then they call cocktail. I just took a look at it now. And I can see when they were saying cocktails, I was thinking it was all those cocktails that they make in glasses that we drink. So it's so you see why it's good to travel. What you know as cocktail in Nigeria might not be what is cocktail in other West African countries. And on that shawarma. What kind of short shawarma is this one? This shawarma is too short too. Eh? That means I have to eat like two. With this, they are cocktail. Okay, so guys, um, I wanted to go to the place where you come to Google. They have a very large package of the market. So we went to the first place that the director got. Because of language barrier, we couldn't really explain what we wanted to the people that we met. We were just doing sign language. So we went to the first place. And when we got there, we were not seeing like newly, you no know, new China things and all of that. And we were not like, we were not asking people, people just have to English from here. Most of them don't understand that. One person now said to me that, go and meet that man, he's evil. I said, really? And I went and met him. And you know that thing that they said, if you go to a place and don't see any person, carry your bags and run rather. I went and met him, I spoke to people to him. That is also a very good reason why you should learn your other tongue. Because had it been, I, I, I don't know how to speak English now, I wouldn't be able to also communicate with you guys. So I didn't bother to speak English, I spoke to people. And I told him what I wanted, what we were looking for rather. And he said, no, 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 that we, we are going to, that we came to the wrong place, that uh, this is not the right place to get all these kind of things, that we have to, he mentioned the name of the place, but trust me, I will forget it. So he had to do a voice recording that I will give to the bike man that and the place is quite far. So we are here now as you can see. This is um it's quite a big market. I just arrived and I'm resting because there is a lot of money. So um we proceed to go into the market and see what and what we have. So madam, how much are these things? Three thousand seven. Yes. Are you serious? Okay, so if people want to talk to men or for women, okay, women and men. Okay, so can you 
send to people in Lagos if they buy. You can send to them. So I should take your number. Which day do you guys open the door? Which day do you guys open your door? Any G two thousand separate. Yes. Anyone? This is the last last lap. Yes. The last last lap. Yes. <laughs> okay, alright, no problem. I'll get your number. So that if any of my subscribers want send it up. How do you send it to you? You don't, okay, you're not understanding. So, you, you guys, you see that thing I'm talking about. Language, really, if you don't know how to speak, you will struggle a lot. But we are good. We've been doing sign language up and down. And I'm sure we'll be fine. Yeah. Her shop number, in case if you come and you're looking for her, yeah. So please um, buy from her because she granted me audience and she let me rest a bit in her store. So let me go to some other place because I don't really want to buy jeans. Yeah.